my name is John Durnley. I'm the Vice President of S&D Spinning Mill, and we manufacture yarn. We manufacture the yarn for the Navy's peacoats, berets, glove liners. We do a lot of apparel work, uh, into gloves, hats, scarves, uh, and we also spin for Rollins. We make all the yarn for Major League Baseballs. This is the uh, picking department where we take these bales of fiber that come into us, we lay them out on the floor and we apply an emulsion. It soaks overnight. It goes into this picker, a feed box, and a mixing unit. And the mixing unit opens up the fibers and, and just kind of blends them like your, your home, uh, home blender. We take this fiber and it's all jumbled up and we're going to cart it into a continuous strand of what we call roving. It's only rub. It's not, it doesn't have the twist put into it so you can just pull it apart. It breaks easily. Feed box right here. We load, the, we load the fiber into the feed box, and this is all controlled here. Uh, the speeds, the dumping, everything, and we start manufacturing the uh, roving. The next step is spinning, where we take that roving and we put it onto these bobbins and the bobbins spin at a high rate of speed and the twist is inserted and we have so many turns per inch and now we have our yarn. And from the spinning department, we'll go onto our cone winder and we'll take four or five of these bobbins and we'll put them onto a cone and along the way they travel through an optical eye looking for any type of defect and that defect is cut out and spliced invisibly with heat and air. Then it goes over next door where it's assembled. We put it into a four ply, three ply, or three ply, depending on what the customer wants or what the specification for the yarn is. This yarn is made to make the core of.